Hi, everyone. So I wanted to show you how I first started recycling plastics before I had any real equipment. So the only two things I had was this oven and this blender that is suitable for blending ice. And what I did was I collected lots of HDPE, mainly from plastic bottle lids. I blended the lids until I got something that looks a bit like this. The finer that you make them, the better your plastic will come out. Okay, what I did was I used some flour and some salt in equal parts with a little bit of water to make a salt dough paste. I made a shape from the salt dough and then I put the salt dough into the bottom of a plastic pot like this and I poured concrete around it. Once the concrete set, I took it out, I removed the salt dough and I ended up with a mould kind of like this. This one I polished a little bit afterwards and I painted it with some sealer, okay, just PVA glue sealer. Once I'd done that, I then was able to take my plastic and I put it into my mould. We need to make sure we fill it really high because when we put it into the oven and it melts, all the gaps that are taken up by air at the moment will not be there and this will shrink quite a lot. Okay, and we're gonna squash it a little bit to try and get out some of the air bubbles. So we fill it like this, so it's protruding a lot. We then stick that into the oven at 170 degrees Celsius. So I've left the plastic in the oven now for about 25 minutes at 170 degrees Celsius. Now it's started to melt. I'm going to use a piece of wood, this one, is a laminated piece of wood and I'm just going to press it down to try and get out some of the air bubbles and make it fill the mold a little bit better. So it's been about 10 minutes, it's now nice and cool. As you can see it's stuck in the mold, which is kind of expected. So I'm going to get a screw and I'm going to throw it in. Now with the screw it's easier for me to pull my shape out of the mold, so I'm going to hold it and I'm going to pull it carefully out. There we go. So you can see with my mold I have a little bit of plastic flowing over the edges here. And if I turn it over, you can see some of the concrete has stuck to my mold. Now, this is the 30th time that I've used this mold, and it's the first time that this has happened, but it's kind of expected. What I would do now is I would polish this mold if I wanted to use it again and put a little bit more sealer around it because it's only the top layer that has broken off, as you can see here. Closer. I'm just zoom in on this and me. Okay, so I can get a file and I can file the edges to make it nice and smooth and to get rid of some of that concrete that got stuck inside. and then we can polish the edges here with some wet and dry paper and make it look a bit more professional.